Okay, so while I was obsessing, I can't even remember. Uh, it was on a uh, Wicked Moonlight, I think is her name. It was a like a live chat. I need to figure out how to stop bump, running and <laughs> bumping this thing. Um, okay, anyway. Someone mentioned this in her chat, uh, Raven's Wand. And so I looked it up. Stephen Hutton. That's not the... Hmm. Okay. So I looked it up and I thought, okay, well that looks cool. And it's U.S. Games. Um, here, let me uh, open it. So I looked on the back here and it says, Inspired by Stephen Hutton's popular Dark Raven Chronicles trilogy, D uh, Raven's Wand Oracle. And I thought, well, that's interesting because I, you know, I hadn't heard of that. Uh, not that I really I haven't kept up with, um, you know, <laughs> with books. Oh, wow, hey, look at that. It's a thing here, flap. I really like this, uh, this light purple with this dark teal. I like the backs. That's cool. This is nice. Okay, so the, okay, I, I'm thinking tarot and I'm like, what? Okay, so I have to remind myself this is Oracle here. So I have to say, I, I'm already, I like, I really like these bags. I think this might even be like my favorite color, this like dark teal color. Um, I'm curious what I would do if I, if I knew these stories. Well, that's kind of cool. Uh, I really like this. And I'm surprised I don't know, I, I would think, uh, no, that thing is pretty weird. Da okay, Daisy and the Dandelion, okay. Um, oh, this is really cool. So I'm going to... So I think I will do my weird shuffling and I will draw a card. Okay, taste before judging. Okay. See the message here. Just before judging, I, at first glance, it seems Rilla Baldragon is in the clutches of a nightmarish figure, but all is not as it seems. The straw monster is merely a costume worn to honor the harvest. There is nothing but celebration here as Rilla, 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 Rilla's relaxed posture clearly shows. First impressions are just that. They, for, uh, they come first. We must look harder. That just made me think of the Head and Shoulders commercial. We must look harder to see um, the true picture. Perce preconceptions often limit our willingness to experience new things, which can be harmful enough. Let loose, however, they, uh, they grow into full-blown prejudice. Oh, I see. Uh, taste first, then decide. Oh, we even have a reversed meaning here. So, a nightmare figure uh, clearly shows first and first are just that. They come first. We must look harder to see the true picture. Preconceptions often limit our willingness to experience new things, which can be harmful or not. They can, uh, they can, uh, taste first on the side. Huh. 
Well, I mean, at first, my first judgment of this of this deck is that I like it. So I'm I'm hoping I'm hoping <laughs> I'm hoping that that's an accurate an accurate judgment. So um, I don't know if I. Oh wow, okay, it is kind of a, a guy like uh, has got hands here. I'm wondering if I should avoid the story, if I should try to read the book, um, read the, the, the story meant the, the trilogy here, um, if that would help or hinder the, the use of these. Sometimes I kind of like not knowing things, um, but what is going on? Why is this? Okay, I put it on there. So, yeah, preconceptions. Taste before judging. Well, that is a good message. Um, yeah. I think I got this off of... Um, I think I got it off Amazon. And then on, on US Games, I think their site, I think it was out of stock. So that's odd to me. That It's kind of weird. A little dent. Anyway, uh, I'm really pleased. This is a nice surprise. Uh, I really like this so far, so thanks for watching.